It's okay, bro. I know your girl cheated on you. Just relax, bro. Take a deep breath. Gary, you didn't have a rainbow screen this time, Scuba. Man, it looks like Steam and Battle Mode be fucking. What's it called? On Steam. On the outside to the right. Oh. It's always like the same crash. My game just like. Oh, I fell off the top. I fell off the map. I don't know how to get back up. Yeah, the only people uh, I see. The right side on. still. Just oh, we got the only people I see having issues with stability are the like. Oh yeah. my god. Oh my god. Why am I? Why Check am I? Right, Ali. Ali. No! Oh. He grabbed up! Behind you, Ali. Yeah. I didn't know there was an area on the map you could just fall into the ground and stuck and die. I didn't this know that. This game works well for the way she plays. Aiming and walking everywhere. Oh, I'm trying to be more quiet. And shut the uh, shut the f up, seriously. <laughs> I don't need it. Ali, outside. I got him. A <laughs> shitty job, bro. Here comes my spot nade. You ready? I'm ready. Right over the fucking tree every time. Almost a guaranteed kill. Valkyrie made mistakes. Eliminate the objective. Shut up. Please don't say that. <laughs> Manifesting it now. Oh, you got hit marker down below. And flash. Oh! oh god. No! Oh, I fell in the hole again! Bro! <laughs> That's the oh, second time! No! Oh, god damn it! Uh, what the fuck? That being such a klutz. I know. There's no way that fucking hit markers at that range. Bro, like, can they put a sign up or something? Like, my hope will never die. I hear him coming up the stairs. Dead. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. Hey, I got the plant boys. It's all the betters. <laughs> Get inside. Okay. He's in our spawn. Dude, he's inside the building. Oh my god. He was laying down in the ADO. I know, but Scuba's beautiful and killed him, so... Oh, Scuba. That pistol. 
Yeah. Oh. <laughs> One left. Oh my wow. god, Tim saved you! Look at him, bro. Put him in war zone. Yeah, he's cheating on his girlfriend. His very hot girlfriend. Oh my fucking god. No. <laughs> <laughs> very hot girlfriend. <laughs> I mean, she would definitely be hot, that's for sure. Hey, yeah, bro. Smoking hot, bro. I mean, you're 18 and 0, bro. She gotta be so a ton. There's one Meg uh, <laughs> Megan Fox type of hot, bro. Fucking weird, bitch. I just hit myself with a grenade. God damn it, Alex. Oh my god, I- okay. I do great things, and then I do stupid things like that. Keep suppressing oh him! God. Hit him! No! Oh my god! Oh, what is the fucking- <laughs> Did you see I me just slide that. across him? I tried to knife him. Yeah, I tried to knife him, bro. I, I tried to know. knife him, dude. Make, I almost make, got him, I was so close to the guy. Look, I was so close. Ah, oh, bro. <laughs> dude, you, I slid so far right there, what the yeah, fuck? Yeah, you did. Damn, bro, 20 and 1, I'm crazy, I'm but like, you're cheating. <laughs> you should have put a chopper gunner on, dude. I had a heli. <laughs> I don't have a chopper gunner. <laughs> cool. uh. Hey guys, relax here. I hope you enjoyed that little gameplay on Payback. And just for this last little bit of the video, I just wanted to quickly talk about what my first and early impressions are of the game, and specifically the Search and Destroy, playing it for just about a week. I will say that with this game, it's definitely different, and I don't really know if it's like a good kind of different or a bad kind of different. It's a little bit of both, to be honest. I mean, going from a game to silent footsteps and surge to being a game mode where you can hear surge, hearing literally almost everything. Like, you can sound whore people like crazy in this game. Like, it is actually mind boggling the amount that you can hear on this game. And I will say definitely right off the rip, Ninja is definitely a necessity. I run Ninja on my classes. I run primarily Ninja, Fast Hands, and Double Time. But let me just talk about quickly what I enjoy about the game and what I think things can be worked on. So the first thing I really want to say is that I really do like the new Omni movement. I feel like that's pretty cool. It's a fun concept. Being able to strafe and move around the way you can in this game is definitely very unique. and definitely makes it a lot more different than other cars because usually you know like if you want to run backwards you have to quickly turn around and slide cancel away but this game you can just like you can just walk backwards and i think that's definitely cool you can definitely create a lot of outplayability factor in this game which is something i feel like you couldn't really do in a lot of cars you could to an extent but this game i'm definitely looking forward to seeing not only what i can do but what other people can do because there are some demons on this game i'm running into quite a couple demons on this game people who were in New Zealand for the first day, um, playing it before it came out on American servers. Uh, so there are definitely a lot of demons. You know, I've seen a couple of Prestige threes. There, are, you know, a bunch of content creators racing the max Prestige and all that, which is fine and all. But I don't know if I'll get to max Prestige in this game. I probably will, but you know, I'm only Prestige one right now. But you know, I just want the VMP. All right, I'm a slut for the VMP. I'll admit it. I originally wasn't going to prestige at all. I'm, I'm getting off topic. I'm a fucking idiot. Anyways, one of the things that I do think they definitely need to work on is the maps. Right now, the map subsonic. A lot of these maps are just awful. I'm, I'm, like, I'm just going to say, a lot of these maps are horrible. And before anyone comes saying, oh, you're just complaining. You're just complaining. Bro, play these maps and tell me these are good maps design. Like, there are only, I think, about, like, five or six maps i genuinely like enjoy and some of them are just awful scud awful vorkuda also awful this map right here even is awful to an extent and that kind of brings it to one of my biggest issues right now is that's how snd plays again it's early so i don't want to think that this is going to be it for the entire game but the amount of people who play snd so weirdly like the amount of creatures and weirdos i have seen or i've died to in this game is crazy so far but i don't remember it being this bad especially not even last game last game it wasn't even this bad 
But I'm going to show you a clip right now, and on this very map, it wasn't in this match, but it's on this very map. I get killed by this guy on the tank. You're going to see it here. I get killed by this guy on the tank. There are four people on that side of the map. One laying prone, one crouching on a head glitch, and this guy's sitting on the back tank. Like, like what the fuck, bro? It's a new game. <laughs> Explore the maps, please. But again, I don't want to complain and all that. I do think that there definitely need to be some maps added when this video is coming out. There will be Nuketown, so that'll be fucking hype to play. And I'm very excited to play that and get some gameplays on that. But they definitely need to add some maps that play better. Because honestly, s &D with how it feels in this game, it feels pretty slow. And that is kind of surprising considering all the Omni movement. You know, this is the biggest thing that they added was the Omni movement. So I'm curious how they're going to change things. Again, it's the first week. This could be just me overreacting. But just from my luck with lobbies and what I've been able to get, my luck's been horrible. My luck's either awful or I am just in the most creature-like creature lobbies ever. But again, if I'm going to recap the positives, the main positive, like, I like the Omni movement. I love the prestige system being back. The guns are very fun to use. You know, the guns feel very fresh. They're not like... You know the regular old guns like they, they feel fresh they feel fun to use and then if i was going to look at the negatives i would definitely say um the maps need to be fixed maps need to be better hopefully they're going to have some in the updates uh, another thing is i don't really know if player base is really like a like a bad thing but again just you know, i don't know really mainly the maps and again maps can make or break a cod and if we were stuck with these maps the entire year, I would not be happy at all. But again, that's not going to happen. Mainly my my three positives and probably my one main negative are just the maps are pretty awful. Oh, actually, another one. A uh, hit reg. I don't know how many people have seen the clips of people putting, like, full mags into people and then them getting immediately eviscerated. I've had that happen to me a couple times. I'm just as confused as they are. I don't know if other people have. If you have, let me know in the comments if you've experienced that because I have and I am genuinely baffled sometimes by the amount of bullets I put into people and I just get immediately just ripped by a jackal or an MP5 or something like that. But those are probably the two main things. I think this game genuinely has a lot of potential to be very fun, but I really hope SMD does not play this slow because if it does, I am going to be bored out of my mind. But those are just my quick thoughts. Again, this is the first week, all right? Don't take any of this seriously. This is just from my impressions. Again, everyone has a different opinion. Everyone's respectable to their own opinion. So let me know what your opinions are in the comments down below, not only on this game, but with the search in general. Hope you enjoyed the gameplay that I just put on the background. I hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned for more videos. I'm definitely trying to make the best content possible this year. And thank you again to the people who have subbed from last game. You know, I started making MW3 content at 209 subs. Now being, or not started at 209, fuck, started at 52, I'm now at 209, so thank you so much to all the people who have subscribed, who have liked, who have commented, whatever, and even just watched, I genuinely appreciate you guys, but anyways, thank you so much for listening to me, I will see you all in the next one.